guys and girls it's Claire welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome my name is Claire Nisha and I'm gonna be doing a purse review today if you're not new thanks for coming back and I'm gonna be making some really exciting content and we have a new season coming up we have a lot of things you know we have school and stuff so I'm, a, I'm gonna have a lot new um, content coming out so just stay tuned um, today's video is going to be showing my most recent purchase well one of my most recent purchases I got a purse off of Amazon and I'm going to be talking about it and showing it in this video so let's go ahead and get started okay guys so um this is the purse and like I said, I got it off of Amazon. I added some charms that I got from Mexico. I mean, not charms, but it's like, I forgot what they're called, but um, I never used them until now. Like, this is how old they are, guys. That the, it came at like the little like water or water looking stuff inside of it, and there's literally nothing in there now. So I don't know where the liquid went, but it's not there anymore. So, um, I just have that around it. I hope this is like good lighting. I try to record it like in a park where there's like, you know, the sun and where it's still daylight. So it's a little bit hot out here, but I'm still gonna tell you guys some really important stuff about this purse. Okay, number one, the brand is called Dacian, I believe, and it's a brand, um, I believe is only on Amazon. So. Since Amazon is a pretty easy to use site and they have really great deals, this site, I mean this company or brand is um, really budget friendly and they um, offer a great variety of purses and bags um, that you can choose from. So they did have a backpack purse that I was considering that you guys saw in um, one of my I don't remember what video was it but in a previous video that's what I was gonna choose but I realized that it some people were saying that's like more like a school backpack the size and I don't really want to be walking around with a huge backpack I really like the like little backpack purses so this is what I went with it's called a wallet it's called a wallet purse and it's in the color of black so it just it's black and gold it has the brand right here it might be backwards I'm not sure um, it comes with this little band if I can pick it off it comes with this strap and it's pretty long I'm pretty tall so it fits a good bit on me and it's like not too high not too low which was a big factor for me it also can be worn as a wristlet if you want to take these off this is how you clip it you just clip it on the side um, it comes with really, really nice packaging. Um, it's shipped in a decent time. I didn't pay for Express, so it shipped in a decent time. I think it was on like a week and maybe a couple of days. So I, it probably shipped a little bit faster before COVID, but with COVID, probably shipping a little bit slower. But all you have to do is just unhook, if you guys can see. Um, all you have to do is unhook it from the side. It's kind of hard. Um, is like how long it is so another thing that I thought of is you could actually probably like connect it to this part where the wristlet goes and you could wear it around your waist I'm not gonna try it um, but you probably could but it is kind of long I'm pretty sure there's a way you can shorten it I'm pretty sure that's what this is for so it is kind of long but there that would be another way that you can wear it but the main two ways are just like long crossbody and wristlet so this is what it looks like as a wristlet. And you would just like the... Just like Like more out of, out and about type. Um, but the crossbody is also a really good um, way to wear it if you want to have a purse. Um, some really good ways that you could utilize this purse is... Um, like if you are going to the zoo or if you're going to the aquarium like me and my family last year we went to the aquarium and um the New Orleans or the NOLA Museum of Arts and we also went to the aquarium so this would have been really really great of uh, then personally my mom has a huge purse and she has considered getting one of these as well she doesn't have hers yet but she's considered it uh, this is really uh, the crossbody way 
to. The ice cream truck is here. <laughs> going there right now since COVID, but uh, when life gets back to normal, you may want to go to one of those places. This will be a great way to wear it as a crossbody because you don't have to hold it. You don't have to have it around your wrist. It looks very fashionable and it comes in a variety of colors. So you can really, since it's so affordable, you can have one in every color for every outfit. So I just chose black because um, I wear a lot of different colors. Um, I'm not really a Prince person, but it does have like a like brown and black print and a floral print this video is not sponsored but I thought I'd give a really honest review because some people when the video is sponsored they don't really give an honest review so I'm giving you an honest review from just a regular person who decided to buy a purse off of Amazon okay so as far as the quality goes um, like I said, it was a budget purse, but like you guys know that this was really important for me, not only it not being super expensive. Okay, the ice cream song is kind of getting on my nerves now, but I want some ice cream now. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay, uh, as far as the quality, I was... When I was shopping for this purse, it didn't have to be the best quality, but I honestly wanted to, it to be decent. With the price, you can't expect a lot since it was only $19.99 and then shipping and handling. But I'd say that it was it's decent quality. I'm not looking for something like really, really durable. I didn't want it to be like too hard, but I didn't want it to be like really, really soft. Um, it opens really easily I haven't had that many problems with it I did notice that like some areas aren't that like well sewn and like there were a few things that I would change about it but overall I say that it's like pretty nice I say that I like that they did this little part so if it gets like too heavy this will probably snap off first before the whole thing snaps off so I do like that um, and it's like pretty durable to me um, now as far as the zipping and unzipping um, sometimes when I have more stuff in here it gets a little bit hard um, with me having a like hard case phone the, well the case I have on my phone it's hard um, it can't fit in here but just as of lately I've just been putting my earphones and like some glasses wipes for my glasses since I do wear glasses and like that's something good you could put like lip balm or something else like that's really small and like more slender um, and you really don't really notice it since it's not that much stuff in here you can't really notice it, it doesn't really like bulge out so you know there's that and then I have like a receipt in here and I don't currently have any credit cards in here I have one credit card as of now but my mom keeps it for me so it probably won't be in here but um, another thing you could do if you are like a teen entrepreneur or you um, like have a business or something you could put your business cards in here that's another way you could use it and if you like to keep cash on you there are pockets on each side that if you guys can see that there are pockets on each side that have the credit card holder slots there are um, pockets that you can put your money in so that works too um, there's one there's like another like little pockets kind of dirty now that's how it came guys I didn't really put anything in there so that's how it came um, but I mean you could just it's not that bad so and ow, I'm getting bit by ant no okay there's also a pocket that you could put change in um, or you could put like little things, I guess, if you wanted to. But I currently have nothing in there, but it's decently spacious. And like I said, it's really a wallet. So it's like if a wallet was a crossbody, essentially. It's not meant to be like a huge, it's not meant to be like a real purse. It's only supposed to be like for like your phone, your maybe some money some cards and um that's pretty much it so i think that this is pretty good for a purse like for a teenager or for someone who is not going to be carrying around a lot of stuff um personally i prefer um smaller purses 
I was, since they have such a great variety, um, I was contemplating getting like actual like regular styled purse, but I realized that with me moving around a lot and I don't really like carrying around a purse, but I may get one later on. Um, who knows? Or I may just order another one of these in a different color. I'm not sure, but yeah. So that's my honest review. Um, I think the but I think the price is fair. I think the shipping um, and the packaging was good. Uh, I think the quality is decent. You know, you can't really expect too much for the price. Um, I think the customer service was good. I didn't have to like complain or return it or anything. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. The color, it's true to color. Um, it's not like the faded black. Like some companies will list certain products as um, black and it'll be like faded, but this is like a true black. Um, yeah, that's all I really have to say about it. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this was helpful. And I would rate this a, out of five stars, I would give it a four and a half out of five. There were like a few things I didn't like about it, but overall I think it was pretty good, especially for only 20 bucks. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And if this video was helpful for, for you or helpful to you, Make sure to give a like if you've purchased anything from this brand or if you're planning on purchasing it or if you did purchase already, make sure to comment down below and tell me how you like it and um, yeah. So have a good day or night and I will see you guys. There's a love bug on my camera. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.